2016 turned out to be an interesting year for the winner of Credit Union of the Year in the small asset category. Safe Harbor Credit Union transitioned through two different CEOs before their third, Adam Johnson, fit the bill. We had a CEO that was here. She was here for over 30 years, I believe about 13 years as CEO. She retired at the end of the previous year. Um, then we had a new CEO that was only here for about four months and leadership changed again. Adam stepped up to take on the interim CEO role where he stepped in and did it flawlessly. He's now the CEO now and I think he's doing a tremendous job. The staff rallied behind Adam and really stuck together for the sake of their members and the success of the credit union. I, I just felt everybody had a, still a pretty positive attitude throughout those difficult months. They stuck it out um, primarily because they cared about the members, I think. We all had the same goals. We all knew what direction we were going in. And everybody on staff built into that goal. They bought in and we continued to push forward to that goal. The staff at Safe Harbor made sure that this turbulent time wasn't going to slow them down. In addition to coming closer together as a staff, Safe Harbor Credit Union had a huge year in terms of growth. We still had over 25% uh, loan growth. We had over 18% membership growth, deposit growth. I mean, our delinquencies were down. So that's huge to a small SSI credit union like us. I think one reason we've been growing is because of uh, people around here looking for a community-minded financial institution. Our credit union is very personable with our members. They develop a trust in us. They're loyal, a loyalty with us that I don't think a lot of credit unions have. That mindset carries on outside of Safe Harbor's walls. The credit union goes into schools and provides financial literacy training to students in grades 1 through 12, including those with learning disabilities. I love being able to teach, it doesn't matter who they are, about financial literacy. So I think it's of the utmost importance to reach kids before they graduate from high school to teach them the difference between a credit card and a debit card. Once they go to college, how much debt are they going to be in after college? That's what I love doing, and I think that's something that Safe Harbor, we want to invest more in the community. People invest in us, they put their money because they trust us. Now let's go back and invest in our community. A credit union that is truly doing great things. Congratulations, Safe Harbor Credit Union. This year's Credit Union of the Year in the Small Asset Size category.